Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. father and his young son. Now the grieving widow and mother is making a plea for help finding their killer. Here's Rick Williams with tonight's Crime Fighters report. Vanessa Frame remembers her husband, Gerald Jerry Parks, and her son, Jamel Parks, as being two sides of the same coin. I always tell him he was his father's child because they was just like the same. He was just like the most um, friendliest little boy in the world. She says the night of Sunday, May 29th, 2022, she was expecting the pair home from a cookout at a relative's house. At 10.37 p.m., she heard something outside her home along the 2100 block of Carver Street in Philadelphia's Wissanoming section. So I just heard all this noise, the sound like gunshots, which woke me, like kind of made me jump out of my bed. She says she saw Jerry's car with Jerry and Jamel inside it. Both the 37-year-old and the 9-year-old had been shot. They were taken to nearby hospitals where they were pronounced dead. Seeing both of them laying in a car the way they were, it's just like very, very tragic, right? It's nothing that a person would want to see. Police say two shooters in a dark-colored vehicle, possibly an SUV, fired at least 13 shots at the car as it rolled past. A, a child lost their life. For, for no reason, you know, he didn't have nothing to do with this. So if it was a problem with Jerry or whatever the case may be, my child had nothing to do with it. The city of Philadelphia is offering up to $20,000 in reward money for information that leads to the arrest and conviction of the person responsible. All you have to do is call the Citizens Crime Commission at 215-546-TIPS. All calls will remain anonymous. It's horrible for people to know what happened and just not say anything. I just don't understand it. For Crime Fighters, I'm Rick Williams. For action. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.